What is going on guys, it's me Randall465 and welcome today to this quick, easy, simple tutorial on how to build the Kinkers Construct Structure for advanced smelting, you know, so that's for advanced weapons and everything, and this is for Feed the Beast Unleashed. Now this is very, very straightforward, all you're going to need is you're going to need 17 seared bricks, one smeltery controller, two seared tanks, you can have one if you wish, but I always use two. Smeltery drain, two of them. I recommend a casting basin, casting table, and two seared faucets. Now, all is very, very straightforward to make. Um, when you actually make your seared bricks, to make seared bricks, all you need is sand, gravel, clay. So, exactly in that order. So, you'd have sand, gravel, clay. Very, very simple and easy to do. Right, so. Once you go ahead and made the, made your seared bricks anyway and made everything that you're going to need, you just want to quickly mine out a 3x3 three three area into the ground. Now, I say into the ground is so it's easier, it's not high up, it's nice and low. It, it, better for access, really. So once you've done that anyway, you want to place the three, well, nine of the seared bricks down. So you have that. Next, you want to place your seared controller or your smeltery controller, is it? Yep, anywhere on the outside of this box above it. So, them bricks there on level 63, and then we're on 64. So, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna whack it there in the center, and then you just want to place a tank either that side or that side. It doesn't matter, this tank could be anywhere on the same floor, but it has to be out this 3x3 three three area. So, yeah. It's, it might sound complicated, but it's not. Um, so once you've done that anyway, you'll end up with that. Next, all you want to do is you want to place... You just fill up these walls. Don't worry about the corners, just do the walls. Um, now, I seem to be missing one, but that's not a problem because I'm going to be placing my drain there. So once you're done anyway, you'll end up with something looking like this. And you'll know that it's running because now this front fascia is actually lit up orange. Um... So as you can see, we've already placed one drain, so what we want to do is we want to go ahead and place a faucet on the end of that. And then off that, we're going to place a casting basin down. Um, now, note, these uh, drains, faucets, can be any level of this. This can go as high as you want it to go. There's no height restriction. Um, it can go as high as you want when you want. Um, so yeah, so the next thing you want to do is now you want to make room for the other drain so i'm just going to do it here on this corner also you just want to knock out a block and then put it there and then the same thing you just want your casting table to go below your faucet so that is the basic construction guys it's very very simple very straightforward to do so let me quickly go ahead and move this out of my inventory real quick um but yeah so the way you power it anyway is you need some lava uh which i don't have any of once you get the lava anyway, all you want to do is you want to put the lava in the tanks, just fill up the tanks, and then you'll have a power bar here that goes up, and it tells you how much power you got. But yeah, guys, that is it. Simple, straightforward tutorial. That's how easy it is. Like I say, there's no height restriction. If you want to know how to use this thing, please, please, please drop a comment. Also, hit the like button, and uh, I will happily help you guys out by making another tutorial showing you how to make the advanced weapons. But yeah guys, other than that, it's me Randall465 and I'm out and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Adios.